As you can see here, the questions are written a little bit jumbled, but it says, in a survey of 30 families, the findings were that 15 families own dogs and 12 own cats. Six families own both dogs and cats and eight families own the neither, neither dogs nor cats. So let's see represents the family who own cats, D represents the family who own dogs and you represent the total families in the survey. So it says, um, using this information above, complete this Venn diagram. So as you can see, the union up here is 30, or the universal set that's 30. All right, now how many? Then I always like to put in intersection next. All right, so we know we put the 30 here, and then I love to go intersection next. What's the intersection? How many families have both cats and dogs? X families own both cats and dogs. So X goes in the center, All right? And then the next thing I like to do is look at what's on the outside. Eight families own neither dogs nor cats. So eight's on the outside. Let's bring this over a little bit. That should be fine, so it's on the outside. Then now, he wants to know cats and dogs. How many families own strictly dogs? 15 families own dogs, All right? So in here, which is cats, how many family own cats? 12 families own cats, so right here, we're gonna have 12 minus X, and then over here, we're gonna have 15 minus X. Nice and easy. Then the question goes further to say, write an expression in terms of X, which represent the total number of families in the survey. Now the question said expression, not equation. So because it's an expression, expression to represent total families is gonna be 12 minus X plus X plus 15 minus X plus eight. That is the expression. All right, you can simplify it if you want. 12 plus 15, which is 27. 27 plus eight, which is 35. Then minus X plus X cancel. And so this is 35 minus X. That's the expression that represents the total number of families in this survey. Now, the next part of the question goes further to say, write an equation in which you may use to solve for X. The equation is just gonna be 35 minus X equal to 30. That's the equation clearly because the universal set, it told us that is 30 families in total. And then they didn't ask for anything else. All right, it says now, the diagram below not drawn to scale shows a parallelogram Using a ruler, a pencil, and a pair of compasses, construct a parallelogram A, B, C, D with A, B being eight centimeters, A, D being six centimeters, and angle D, A, B being 60. All right, so as you can see, this is just a ski, this shouldn't have been there, all right? This is the information, all right? So this is what you're supposed to construct and this is just a representation of what it should look like, all right? This is a representation of the parallelogram that you should have, nice and easy. So AB, it being eight centimeters, as you can see, AD being six centimeters and angle DAB, the angle at A is 60 degrees, all right? Remember, you have to put a construction lines to show where oh, you get the 60 degree, show that you swing your arcs and stuff like that, you swing your arcs, all right? Stuff like that you have to show. This is what you should have had though. 
nice and easy.